Hi everyone, it's Desiree. Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for joining me for another video. Today I am going to decorate some planner pages featuring the new Spring Element sticker book from Live Love Posh. This actually releases today. There's a sticker bundle that has all the seasons or you can buy them individually if you um, want to just get one season or a couple seasons. And I do have a discount code. I think if you buy this individually, you might be able to use, I think you can use them on the individual. I'm not sure on the bundle. I don't know if that one's a different price point or a reduced price point, but definitely use my affiliate link or somebody's affiliate link um, and a discount code if you can. But I'm going to use this book again to decorate this spread. And I actually asked my patrons which sticker sheet I should use. I gave them a few options and they voted on this one. This one's a really pretty um, floral sticker page. Actually, there's two pages. There's some fun like planner elements in here too. Oh, and there's cute butterflies. Love that. So I'm going to use this to decorate this page over here. And I'm going to try my best to just use this book because it kind of has everything that you need. We have some checklists and headers and bullet points, boxes, quotes, and then the decorative stickers in here, which is really nice because sometimes it's just easy to just pull a book, just use one book and make a gorgeous spread using it. So yeah, that's the plan. So I'm actually going to take these out because I believe these are perforated. Yes, super easy to take out. It makes it a little bit easier to do that. And I'm going to first start off, I think, I want to just start putting florals down. Um, okay, like these big florals. These are all paper stickers, which is nice because then I don't have to worry about like covering up. And, and in this layout, this will be really nice because seeing all these lines and the shading and stuff would not be fun with clear stickers. Sometimes there's like, I like using clear, but then in these instances, I like using paper, just a little bit easier. Okay, so we got a pretty floral there. I'm gonna put a girl down. Actually, I wanna bring in some washi. So this is gonna be the only element I bring in that's not from the book because it's washi. Let me grab, and I just want like a very basic washi. If I'm gonna put a girl down. I like to have her like kind of standing on something in a way. In a sense, I guess. I don't know. Just one of my things. So I have this pretty purple washi. This one is from Amazon. Okay, so I'm just going to add the washi. Then I have these fun washi cutters. These are from Live Love Posh too. So if you're ordering and you want something else to add to the cart, these are amazing. I love using these to cut washi. So I'm just gonna add the washi on the bottom. It's easier to do it this way. Okay, cut there and then a little cut here. All right, and I'll probably add more washi in a bit. I just wanted to get that down. And then I can add a girl. Just add this girl. Let's see, let's see. Do I want to do a scene? There's these like chairs. Mm. No, I'm going to do just her in this corner. Okay, I'll need to put like some boxes or something over here too. So I'm going to go back into the book. Ooh, actually, let me grab a quote. I love these. Quotes. Let's grab this springy one. Blossom by blossom, the spring begins. It's cute. There's a nice variety of quotes in here, which I really like. So I'm just going to put this here. Cool. And then let's do. Okay, I'm going to put a box. Grab a box. I'm gonna do purple. Do a box here. And actually, a little more up. And then I do want to add some florals. 
Let me get these. Actually, kind of on top. Again, another great reason why having paper is better because you could just slap it on and don't have to worry about covering things up, which is nice. I'm gonna grab a blue box here. I want it this way. Okay. Let's see. Okay, what else can I add over here? Oh, I like this little birdhouse. That's cute. We'll just put this on. Actually, I want to cut this off a little bit. I'm going to stick this on top. Okay. Definitely going to add a butterfly because I love the butterfly elements in a spring kind of spread. So we'll just put the butterfly here. And I'm just going to draw some little, like a little trail, a little flying kind of trail. Going around, do a little loop bit here, kind of going up a little bit. So yeah, still like leaving space to write, but I love that little detail, cute, cute. Um, I feel like I need something, oh, more boxes. I'm gonna put more boxes. So I'm going with this like blue and purple color scheme, which is nice put a box here oh also I have like headers so let's put some headers down I want to do one like going this way because I like that look so we'll do to do going this way and then I can do important for this one good um, also, there are checklists in here, which is nice. I doubt they're going to match up to the lines of this planner, but that's okay. So I'm just going to bring in, I kind of want to bring in pink. Yeah. Oh, and I really like these checklists. These are nice checklists. So we'll just add one here because on the weekends I'm always a little bit busier. A little checklist there. Uh, maybe I could do some bullet points over here. Let me do another red pink box over here. Pretty. Okay, let me get some bullet points going. Maybe here. So let's see what color I don't want to do. I feel like purple. Actually. Maybe pink. Oh, I need to figure out a way to add in more washi. Okay, so a couple of bullet points. Let's see. I don't know, maybe like blocking or I don't really use this layout. This is just like a little mock spread I'm doing, but I kind of like the idea of like separating these two like this. I actually like that. Okay, that works. I think that looks really pretty. Okay, I feel like that side's pretty done. And I gotta move on to this side over here. Okay, now, let's see what I got over here. Now, the girl is the same girl, so I'm not going to use the girl, but I am going to add in some of these pretty florals. So I have this pretty purple one that I can add in over here coming off the page. Oh, wait, wait. A little bit off. Okay, I have to wipe this out too. 
Only because you'll see it since the sticker is not covering it up. Okay. And then, oh, there's a cute little bird. Definitely adding the bird. Um, this one's cute too. Oh, let me add. Okay, let me get some boxes. So I'm gonna do like this blue box, the bigger version. Did a terrible job covering that up, but that's okay. okay so I'm gonna get this blue box, but I'm gonna put it this way on the page. So florals, we'll get this big cluster of florals here. Kind of layer that together. Nice little cluster. And then I can put this a little bit higher here. Let me put the washi down. It's going to be a little bit of washi, but that's okay. Just so I can get it to match this side. I feel like that's super crooked. Oh my goodness. You know what? We're leaving it. We're leaving it. It's okay. It's not that crooked, I don't think, but... A little crooked, I feel. <laughs> That's okay. Okay, I'm gonna get a purple box. Layer this over here. We'll try. We'll try to hide the crookedness of that sticker. Let's see. Um, I'm gonna add like a little planner element here. Is bloom where you are planted. Okay. Um, I also want to add, oh, I need to add a butterfly. So I'll have the butterfly going off the page this way. Oh, wait, no. Hmm. Actually, I kind of want it coming off the other way. So that way it's kind of opposite, I guess. Oops. I always mess up doing this, but you can never tell. So thankfully the mess ups are very easy to hide. Okay, so that looks good that way. And then let me add some more boxes. Oh, and I need to add a, add a header. So let's do this task. I try to get like all the elements that I added on one side of the page to the other side of the page. That's the goal. So I did a checklist. I want to get a checklist over on this side. I probably do a checklist like here. Be good. For me, like Wednesdays are always a little bit busier. Um, so I'll do a pink checklist over here. Add in some pink on this side. Um, go a little bit lower. Oops, it's really crooked on the top. All right, that works. And then we'll do like some of these little pink boxes. I feel like I should put, actually don't want a pink box because I feel like I have too much pink. So I do want to put some pink bullet points. So I'm gonna do a, let's do a blue box. Okay, I think my video cut out for a little bit, but um, hopefully I didn't cut out too much. I haven't checked. I'm going to add another floral there. Okay, and then let me get the bullet points. I can get some bullet points on the page. I'm just going to do two, kind of like how I did on the other side. I think that was good. Let's 
see if I can fit them here. All right, good. And then maybe another purple little box over here. And then I just have to deal with this sidebar, which I don't have any long stickers, which I normally put on that side. So I have to do something different. But I kind of want to also see there's this cute little bow. No. Okay. Never mind. There's some, oh, there's this yellow flower. No, I don't really have yellow, so I don't want to add that. Okay. So, oh, the bird. The, bird. the bird's kind of big, though. Why is he so huge? Let me just add the bird here. You know what? Maybe I could add the bird on top of a box over here. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, let me see what I'm going to do for this side because I don't know yet. I do want to add maybe a quote would be nice. So let me go to the quotes. There's a quote that'll fit in that section. It needs to be like a certain width. So... Spring, spring, spring. Mm. Maybe this one says spring is nature's way of saying let's party. Apparently this is a Robin Williams quote. It's cute. Yeah, maybe here, because this fits nicely here. are going well it's actually like crows outside just like squawking away uh, okay i need a purple box so i grab this purple box it's very purpley over here though that's okay all right so we're gonna stick this let's see let me get the bird stick the bird on top Oh my goodness, they're like going at it outside. Which isn't the most pleasant. I always like like the little birds when they're like chirping outside, but the crows are like, I'm not a fan of the crows. <laughs> not a fan. We'll just stick the bird there. Okay. Oh, you know what? Let me do a header. I should have done a header. We're just gonna do it under because I didn't leave space. Okay, that's like the tasks for the week. All right, pretty. Okay, so that is the spread. I always love when I have a book that I can just use this one book to make a spread. And there are four versions of this book in different seasons, which is really cool. So they have like the same kind of setup just with the different seasons and yeah made a really pretty spread so the only thing I brought in was the washi everything else came from this book so really love that again these are releasing today so definitely check it out I'll have this link to down in the description although I did notice one thing oh my goodness sorry sometimes when I like finish then I realize I did something I didn't like so let me fix it I don't like to have task tasks on both sides aye, aye, aye. Let me just fix this. We'll put goals instead. I always have, like to have a different word, especially if it's like right next to each other. So sorry. Okay, let me just fix that really quick. All right, so yeah, that is it for this video. If you're interested in purchasing these books, there will be the link to purchase is down in the description. That's my affiliate link. I also have a discount code, so definitely check that out. But that's going to be it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed watching. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And I hope to see you in the next video.